everywhere I was driving, people were like pointing, pointing, men in the street are like pointing, pointing. Greetings Weight Watchers and friends. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Love Fuller and I'm here with the What I Ate on Weight Watchers Smart Points. I track bites do with intermittent fasting day in the life video. Okay. I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to show you today, but uh, it is 11 a.m. and I am sitting, in case you're become familiar with Kuwait, I'm sitting outside of the gates of the Al Shaya complex, or well, at least one of the Al Shaya complexes. If you know Al Shaya, Al Shaya is a corporation that owns many of the major companies here, like. I think there's like Bloomingdale's, Mark and Spencer. I don't know if these are the exact stores that they have, but you know what I'm saying? Like they have like all these major stores, restaurants, KFC, Hardee's. I don't know if these are the exact stores, but Pizza Hut for sure, things like that. So they're the ones who have the, the um, they own all of those stores in Kuwait. So um, that's Al Shia. And I'm going into the staff store because staff members can bring their friends and family into the staff store where the prices are discounted. So I'm being invited as a friend of someone who works at Al Shia. So there's that. It's 11 a.m. I haven't had anything to eat. I have lunch at 3. So I know I'll have that. Maybe after this shopping, I'm not a big shopper, so it's just like it's just an interesting thing to do. My husband's birthday is coming up on Thursday so I'm gonna get him some stuff for sure and that's about it um lunch I am having a problem with my car I'm sitting here like la di da but yeah meanwhile I'm having a problem with my car my garage is actually right around the corner but I'm not sure if it's gonna be open so my husband's calling while I'm here about to go shopping and we'll see what happens okay so I'm here shopping and the uh, store Getting my husband some jeans, hopefully, from American Eagle. So hopefully the cut will be right. And I'm not going to show you around because I'm not sure if I'm allowed. So I'm going to be respectful. But just letting you know that I'm here and I'm at shopping. Came to this place. I'm having a problem with my car. That plastic piece underneath is dragging. Just the guy who's willing to get under the car and push the thing back and stick it in and screw it in. Alhamdulillah. I give thanks to God. I said Alhamdulillah because I'm in this area. That means giving all thanks and glory to God that I happen to be at the um, at coming to this area, coming to this complete car repair, car sales industrial area in order to go to the to the store to the um, staff store. Everywhere I was driving, people were like pointing, pointing. Men in the street are like pointing, pointing. Like it's like the perfect area. I know two areas that are that have um, lots of car repair places, and they're on complete opposite ends of Kuwait. And I happen to be in the one when my car is like having a problem. Whatever the thing was dragging underneath, the guy I think he was telling me that he wasn't going to pay me any, charge me anything or whatever I wanted to give him. But luckily I pressed because I was going to give him like five KD. So luckily I pressed him like to say like because I wasn't sure what he was saying, and he just told me three KD. So. Yay, 3KD, 10 bucks for them to go under my car and fix it. This is a food vlog, right? So it's 1.20 p.m. And I uh, am headed to, um, I'm headed to a restaurant to meet up with these ladies, seafood restaurants. Um, it's interesting because I'm also meeting up with the, uh, those other people I told you at a restaurant. But I'm going to just meet up with these ladies that I was chop shopping with. Um, and I'm going to have seafood with them. I thought I wasn't going to go to the to the seafood, right? I'm gonna, I thought I was not going to be able to make it to the seafood, but I ended up pushing back my later appointment because I, I thought it was going to be longer at the car repair place, and um, luckily it wasn't. So I'm going to check out the seafood place so that I can know about it. Um, if I want to have something to be really super low smart points, I can know about it for myself and for my husband. And also it's um, in the area where, like the, the neighborhood, general neighborhood there, I'm going for the second meetup, and then I have a third meetup. So, busy day. Um, I did some good shopping. I got some nice things for, um, I got some clothes for my husband. 
which hopefully they'll fit and everything will be fine with that. And I bought um, some, and I'm sure most of them I'll show you when I get home. This is going to be a longer longer vlog. And then I'm going to, um, and I bought some houseware things. I love H&M Home. And so the stores that were inside there were our Harvey Nickel, which is like a British uh, store. I don't think we have that in the States. It's like a very high-end store. It's like they, they sell haute couture stuff. So it's Harvey Nickel. It was um, American Eagle and H&M. So I bought hubby, hubby some clothes from, from American Eagle. I bought housewares from, from H&M, H&M housewares. And I bought nothing from Harvey Nickel. Actually, I did. I bought some... some um, some like snacks so some goodies from Dina DeLuca so from Dina DeLuca I bought some um I'll show you when I get home I'll do a actually maybe I'll do maybe I'll do a separate video for as the haul I'm not sure so obviously if you're from Kuwait you know Boulevard or you're in Kuwait I should say Hey, so, ooh, I was so happy that I went to the seafood. So that it was yummy and delicious. Um, I would say that, ooh, that sauce, you saw that sauce. It looks like tomato sauce, but it's tomato sauce and it had oil in it. So the sauce was probably pretty pointy, but um, of course everything else, nothing else I ate has any points except for the corn. So I had probably like, mmm, I would say like a piece of corn on the cob, you know, like a medium sized piece of corn on the cob. So I do have to put points in for that, but points are negligible, even though I'll quit they're not zero because I'm not doing freestyle, but negligible for the seafood. It was so good. Now I'm heading to another restaurant. I gotta say that I didn't eat, like overeat, like there was like, oh, there was rice there. I did have some rice. I had about, Mm. I had about a half cup of rice. I did eat about a half cup of rice. And that was it. So I got to count that. And I mean, I might say just in case three quarters cup, three quarters of a cup just to be just to be safe. I don't like to under underestimate. The cool thing is that all three of the people I was with three other people, all three, three of the people at the table do intermittent fasting that's wild isn't it so the lady was like oh yeah everybody's doing intermittent fasting these days and we're just talking about you know the different ways that we do it the husband says that he does OMAD one meal a day so this is his only meal for the day one person is gluten free so it's just so interesting that these days if you say that you're doing stuff like no sugar nobody blinks their eye as a matter of fact the people that I know I know like they know I'm not eating sugar and they will like if I'm like I'm going to their house like they will make provisions like make sure they don't put sugar in whatever they order something that I can eat that has no sugar and stuff like that so it's like people are really people are really great with, with these things these days I don't know how it is in the states but at least in this expat community here it's really good okay so if you're from Kuwait it's Olympia Mall is this it's an Olympia Mall, if it's next door to this hotel, something like that. So this is what it's called. It's um, Arabic food. Narange. Narange. Uh, Syrian. Syrian. Beautiful already. Yes. Oh my goodness. Like Where are we? Oh. <laughs> Gorgeous. Oh, that salad. Oh, it's a lot of beets. That's beets like crazy. Oh my gosh, yum. 
Put that thing. Yeah. So what is what is that's, that's the artichoke salad. Artichokes. Okay. Yeah, this is the main dish or the pasta. Wow. Exotic yeah. pasta. I'm not sure. And this is the other salad. salad. Well, I accepted this bread because I don't plan to eat it. Uh, it and I'm not eating any of the pasta. We have some water. That's the the lamb. I mean the the veal. That's me. I have yeah. no. The, I guess you are the. the that's me. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Thank you. This looks yummy. Yeah, a veal, stuff with cheese. Oh no. This is free. This is part of it. I just had an orange. Now we're coming to another event. It is, what time is it? After 8. So, no more food. Book club now, a new book club with with Gigi, the the cat whisperer, yeah. the Kuwaiti cat, yeah, yeah. cat whisperer. Hey folks, so it is eleven forty four p.m. Uh, and I am leaving my last event. So, what do I have to say? But I have to say that is that it is Saturday night. My week starts started on Sunday. So I really don't have to put the points in for today, but I do want to I think move and change my week to the, so that it starts on Monday. I'm on the way tomorrow so that I can let you know what my, I don't know. How am I going to do this? I'm going to wait tomorrow, but somehow I'm going to just change the app. I guess I'll just, on Monday, I'll just change the app. So that means I should, whatever weeklies I have left should go to tomorrow, okay? So it's like so complicated, right? I think I'm making it too complicated, but anyway, like I should like extend the weeklies until tomorrow like don't go over my weekly tomorrow or tomorrow I could just do a fasting day and just start everything on Monday something like that I'll just I guess I'll put the points in so that's it I'll put the points in I'll put the I'll show I'll put the points on the I'll show you a screenshot of the app like I normally do and I will See you tomorrow for end of week one weigh-in. So, thank you for hanging out with me today. I enjoyed having you with me. Uh, let me know what you think by leaving a comment. And if you're new to my channel, I'd love to have you join me for more of these day in the life. What I ate on Weight Watchers, some mark points. I track bites. Paleo food plan with intermittent fasting video. So please click the subscribe button for more. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Ciao, friends.